hello everyone welcome and welcome back to my channel and welcome to today's video you guys so i put up a post on my community and my insta story and my whatsapp and all my social media platforms you guys asking you all to tell me your assumptions about me and <laughs> a lot of you are just so so nice a couple of you are just so nice see i was expecting a lot of crazy things but uh, you guys actually impressed me you blow my mind <laughs> so today i'm gonna be reading your assumptions about me you guys <laughs> if that's something that you want to watch then please do keep on watching so i'm gonna be starting from my insta story the first one I got is from NJ Braveheart. She said, LOL, you don't like to share the mola with me. <laughs> she said, I don't like to share the mola, meaning I don't like to share the money with her. Okay, don't worry, babes, okay? Keep watching my videos. Don't skip my ads, okay? <laughs> Join my YouTube membership. And first of all, before I continue, those who are already my members, thank you so much. I appreciate each and every one of you. I wake up to new members and it means a lot to me. Thank you so much. So sis, join my membership, watch my videos, tell your friends to tell their friends and their friends and their community to watch my videos so that the money will increase so that I can share with you, okay? Click on the join button now. Just support your girl, okay? <laughs> Anyways, um, you are wrong on that. I like to share. So if, if you really want to get some coins from me they just reach out okay no matter how small i'm, I'm willing to give <laughs> so the next i got is from stephizy and she said you don't go you go out of your way to make someone happy honestly that is an honest one like very very true i go out of my way a whole lot of times to make people around me happy and comfortable and sometimes it hurts me like i'll be asking myself who sent me why am i being too nice and being too extra but it's just who i am okay i actually do go out of my way to make people around me happy that's something that, that that's just that's me that's joy okay moving on <laughs> So the next one is from Yvonne Kaderi. She said, you are too, you are far too kind. You are far too kind. Um, you are very, very correct. This assumption is so, so on point. I'm very, I'm a kind, if I should say so myself, I'm very kind, okay? I'm a very kind person. I know how to, anyway, let me not blow my own trumpet. Yes, I am a kind person. Thank you so much. <laughs> so the next one I got said, you don't joke with your family girl or boy or whoever you are you are very right i don't joke with my family you know what i happen to be an only child i've said it a couple of times in my video and the annoying part is that i have a video that i did talking about the fact that i'm an only child so i don't know how i'm going to post that video now because you all already know these facts about me okay so i'm an only child so growing up i really did i really didn't have anybody to play with and all that stuff so when I had my own family, God bless me, my family, I don't mess with them, okay? Please, do anything to me, I will take it, but don't joke with my papi and my boys. I'm a deal with you. In fact, I'm a... Okay, for the seven. <laughs> I'm joking, that's been too extra anyways, but I, don't, I really don't joke with my family, so you are right on that one. So the next I got is that you love money. Ha! <laughs> Now wow, <laughs> is there anybody that doesn't like money? Please, if you don't like money, let me know in the comment section. Because me, I like money, I love money, but um, I don't love it to the extent that it controls and commands me. I don't like it to the extent that it controls and, you know, controls my, my, my life, my happiness, when I will be happy, when I will do this, when I will do that, no. But if, I, if you say whether I like money, I like money, oh, please, nobody wants to be suffering because Jesus has paid the price for suffering already, so... <laughs> Yes, I like money, but not to that extent of I can do anything or kill or do some crazy things because of money, okay? The next one I got is from Stephizy and she said that you want to do so many things, but time and things you can't run from slow you down. <sighs> In fact, eh, I wish there's a bottle of wine or something. Let me just sip first, eh? To just gather myself to answer this particular one seriously there are a lot of things that i want to do there are a lot of ideas that i have a lot of things that i tell myself that i want to achieve and again this year is slowly going to an end and i'm not going to beat myself because all of us experience corona together so nobody should even come to criticize or do anything eh? there are a lot of things i really want to achieve a lot of things that i want to do there are businesses that i'm currently running that i feel like i'm not i, I want to do more but with the surroundings i don't want to keep giving excuses the things that are happening the fact that 
I have a little baby and it's just slowing me down, not stopping me because <laughs> ain't nobody gonna stop me, okay? Um, it's just slowing me down a little, so I just need to re-strategize on how to do things so that I don't wear myself out and I don't feel like I'm not doing, um, I'm not hitting my goal. So I just need to re-strategize and come back with full force, you guys. <laughs> And watch out for this space because it's gonna be mind-blowing not just on my youtube career but other businesses that i'm currently handling and doing now i'm gonna introduce it to you guys anyway so just stick around okay stick around <laughs> so the first one i got for my youtube community is from julie bright and she said god fearing patient like to snap pictures and kind <laughs> Yes, you are 150 percent correct. True, I am God fearing. Okay, I, I don't joke with my spirituality. I understand that <laughs> this bread we are taking in is not by our power, but by our mind. It's God that gave it to us. So I understand the purpose of living to um, please the Maker to satisfy your Creator. Okay, I'm very, very really. Let me not say religious. I'm spiritual. I'm, I'm a, I have spiritual upbringing. I'm going to end it there. So also she said I'm patient. Yes, uh, <laughs> I am not very patient. I don't. I didn't used to be patient before, but now with the fact that <laughs> mommy duty, so I am. I've become a very patient person. And um, she also said I like to snap pictures. Please, can you change that like to love? Because I love to take pictures anywhere, any day, any time. Full camera action. I love to take pictures so your assumptions is a hundred and fifty percent correct so the next one i got is from paula's um paulette's lifestyle i'm so sorry sis and she just recently joined my membership this is a round of applause to you girl thank you so much for joining my membership i appreciate you so much okay and she said i also assume you are okay that means she has given a lot okay first she said i assume you can go extra miles for your loved ones I also assume you are a very good mom and wife. <laughs> yes, I can go extra mile for my loved ones, okay? I can do anything for my loved ones. Very, that's 100% correct, correct. But you see this other part where he said, I assume you are a very good mom and wife. Father, amen. Amen. <laughs> Honestly, there are days that I feel like I, I am the homeless. I'm the wackest mom. I don't know which English to use. Now, there are days I just look at my kids and I'm like, oh God, what do I do? What do I do? I'm not doing a good job. God help me. You know, I don't know if anybody feels that way too, but I beat myself up a couple of times. But when it comes to being a good wife, yes, I am the perfect wife, okay? If I will say so myself. In that aspect, I don't have a problem because two of us are putting in effort to make it work. But when it comes to motherhood, I feel like there are days that... I'm not doing so much and I should do so much. So I keep beating myself up even though it's not right. So I, I don't I don't I don't agree with you. I don't agree with you, but I'm trying. By the grace of God, I'm trying. And she also said, I also assume you are a kind-hearted person who doesn't get angry easily. Okay, yes, I am a very kind-hearted person and I don't get angry very easily. No, it takes a lot to make me angry. It actually takes a whole lot of nonsense and yama yama to make me angry um, i can tolerate people to an extent like i can tolerate people to a fault until and unless that that person has just decided not to have sense that's when i'm not just walk away but i can tolerate people so i will say you are right your assumption about me i don't get angry easily it's 100 percent correct okay. so the next assumption i got is from amaka glorious and she said was thinking you are in canada before I get to know you more, okay? She was thinking I'm in Canada. See, if you know me, they are sharing Canadian visa, please. Okay, who can sister up, okay? Um, I'm not in Canada. I am presently, currently living in the UAE, Dubai to be precise. So I also got from Paulette Lifestyle. Say, I assume you are a very emotional person. I have a lot of assumptions about you. Already, I can, I can see them. I can see your assumptions. Anyways, you are very, very correct. I am a very, very emotional person. I know I appear to be somehow strong and tough, but that's just a... Did they call it facet? I be face fashet, I be face. Please, I don't know. That's just a front that I put in. I'm a very, very emotional person. Things get to me a lot. Okay, I can be all dancing, happy this minute, and the next minute I'm in one corner just crying. Not over, not yet, yet. Yes, please. <laughs> 
anyways i'm very emotional you are very very correct i am an emotional person so the next i got is from tracy ojiabonu sis peace <laughs> and she said that you are a praying mom i am a praying person okay i'm a praying person i'm a praying mom but i don't pray to the satisfaction of the way i you know i usually pray maybe because i don't have time or have too many things i'm doing which is not an excuse anyway but i feel like i don't pray as much as i should pray but yes you are you are 90 percent correct i'm a praying mom we need to cover these children with the blood of jesus because ah times are wicked you guys already know so the next one is from Queen Emu and she said you are adorable sis Oh my god sis, thank you so much I love you, thank you so so much I am really adorable right? I am, I know <laughs> I'm adorable, thank you so much So the next I got is from Fitness Freak and she said you have a very happy home Yes, by the grace of God I do have a happy home but it was not originally like this, okay? I remember um, if you if you've watched the video where I talked about my biggest mistakes in marriage you will understand what I'm talking about it was not like this but I thank God that today we have a happy home and it's still a continuous everyday effort to keep it that way and even better so your assumption is 100% correct so the next I got is from Adora Ogechuku and she said that you are happy and fulfilled okay yes I am happy I will not say I am there yet in my fulfillment stage. I am still a work in progress, but I am not where I used to be. I'm far away from where I'm used to where I used to be. I'm still a work in progress. So by the grace of God, I'm gonna de get there and be fulfilled. But yes, I am very, very happy. Okay. The next I got is from the classic holler. And the person said, you look so beautiful, ma'am. Oh my God, the compliments are just making me mushy. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you, thank you so much. I appreciate it. So also, I got from Sun's Kitchen and Lifestyle. She said, like to make people happy and very smart. Yes, I like to make people happy. I said that already. And smart, I am extremely, very smart. Like, <laughs> let me not blow my own trumpet. You guys, I am very, very smart. I, I... I learn quickly. I, I, I'm smart. Let me leave it that way, okay? So the next I got is from my big sis. Shout out to you here by Chris Beggs. I love you so much, sissy. She said, I thought you are in Europe. Hey, God. A lot of people are just thinking Canada, Europe. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I am not in Europe. I am in UAE, Dubai, okay? Even though I would love to visit Germany like you guys. All my German people. <laughs> 2021 by the grace of god we are gonna call europe <laughs> i really love to visit europe anyways but i've never never been to okay so the next also is from Paulette lifestyle like this girl was just giving me bash 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 and she said i assume you are a very emotional person i have lots of okay i think i've read that one yes i'm very emotional so another one i got is from Ephegina dora she said you are looking cute Thank you so much, sis. I really appreciate. Another one I got is from Chef Chini's Kitchen. She say hello, pretty. Thank you. Then Tracy Christ TV say okay, I'm waiting. I said drop your assumption, not your waiting. Your assumption, okay? <laughs> Anyways, thank you. Anyways, you guys, thank you so much for watching this video. It was so much fun filming it. I hope you liked it. If you did, please thumbs up the video, comment down below, share with your friends and your family members and please subscribe if you've not yet subscribed to this channel please hit the subscribe button guys we are on the way to 2k please do this for me okay and until my next video bye and stay blessed